Revit Architecture and Revit Structure 2012 extends the BIM workflow by introducing construction modeling, which supports virtual construction modeling workflows with specific focus on 4D sequencing. The construction modeling project involves three main parts, create parts dividing elements, assemblies, and assembly views. The primary use case for create parts dividing elements is the splitting of slabs, walls, ceilings and roofs for construction workflows. Dividing a valid element will create new elements in Revit called parts. These parts do not eliminate the original parent family from the model. The parent still exists and is fully editable. You can divide parts by using intersecting references including levels, grids, and reference planes. The purpose is to create more accurate schedules quantity takeoffs, tagged, filtered, and exports. It provides visibility control and helps to maintain a persistent design intent model. The second way to divide Revit geometry into discrete parts is by sketching using the traditional draw palette. Valid sketches include closed loop on a surface or any line starts and end at the boundary line. You can redefine the original material from the material library to accurately represent how the building will be built. Also, after creating parts, you can now create part schedule to track more accurate cost estimating and quantification. The shape handles parameter allows you to push and pull the geometry faces to have more control over each construction layer to truly quantify, track, represent, analyze, and simulate the building.